Our coverage continues now on the Jussie Smollett shocker. Our legal analyst Irv Miller joins us to try to make sense of what happened today. Irv, you worked at the state's attorney's office for a decade. You've done defense work. Have you ever seen anything like this? I haven't seen anything even come close to this. This was out of left field. It was done uh, in a very callous manner, and it was not done in a very nice manner in dealing with the Chicago Police Department. There should have been a little professional courtesy and to notify the superintendent as to what was going on, to try to get him on board, to try to make this go smoothly. That wasn't even done. Jesse Smollett seemingly got the biggest gift of his life today. The state's attorney says he thinks he likely did it. He's guilty of it. Then Smollett get up there and basically says he didn't do anything, proclaims his innocence again. Isn't there something to be said about deterrence in a case like this, w wanting to send the message out there that you can't do what he did and get away with it, yet the opposite message was sent today? I don't understand. That's why we have criminal laws. They're there to punish people to do wrong, but they're also there to deter other people from doing the th same things. You don't want the, the, the police and the justice system to say, hey, it's okay if you, you lie to the police. It's okay if you make a false allegation against somebody. No harm, no foul. You don't have to worry about it. That's the wrong message to send. The state's attorney, they were the ones that decided to bring these 16 charges. So they're now the ones that decide to just drop it. What do you make of that? Because it's not like it was only the Chicago police going after Jesse Smollett initially. You know, it's totally within the discretion of the Cook County State's Attorney's Office to bring a charge and totally within the discretion to dismiss a charge. I think they exercise great discretion in bringing the charge, but I have major concerns about their decision, the discretion they used in order to drop this case the way they did without anything in return. Not an admission of guilt, not an I'm sorry, not full restitution. That's what a lot of people are really upset about. Yeah, frankly, the opposite. Smollett getting up there and saying, I'm innocent. He basically said to the prosecutors, oh, thanks a lot. I got you. Yeah. Absolutely. All right. Irv Miller, our legal expert. Thank you, sir. Thank you.